Hello, we're rolling along with more Max Nightmares. Anyway, we are playing Welcome to Hell Town Towns. I don't know. I don't know what possessed me to say that. Maybe it's just the Halloween spirit. That X Files episode where that weird golem was attacking people in this perfect idyllic town, and and Mulder was like, "Fuck this! I want to punch that in the face." Scully's like, "Yeah, I guess." So, um, Helltown, uh, I don't know much about it, other than that was my take on uh, what makes it horrifying, so we will check it out. This is just a bad dream. I'm going to wake up in three. Here comes one. There it is. <sighs> so, yeah, wow, okay. Uh, so, I'm not sure if this uses the voxel style... Um, graphics from um, uh, Minecraft. I think it does, but also has that PS1 era look. Fuck. Uh, the PS1. Uh, so let's just go on ahead. I'm not sure if there's anything following me here, but if I run, it can't possibly get me. Uh, I don't know what that sound is, and I don't know what that white light at the top of the screen is, either. I guess it's nothing. I guess it's just spooking me for spooky's sake. Uh, that PS... Oh, what is that? There is something there. Uh, escape? Oh. Wow. That, that must be a record of... of how fast I got creeped out. Check. Okay, I guess I guess that was a nightmare. That's fine. Yeah, it kind of has that PS1 look, but it's also mixed in with a bit of that voxel art style. Check. Tonight's a night for the record. It's so hot. It's too hot today. I love that outside. Uh, I can this even be considered a skybox? At this point, that guy would be like, yeah, someone just put a big painting of a bad pixelated... Cityscape. Alright. Uh, check. I must get to sleep if I want to do a good job tomorrow. Fresh start. He wants... Yeah, is that what this is? Uh, dear Mr. Rowe, I am proud to offer you the, on behalf of the St. Marion Postal Service position of postman for a new division in the Little Vale Residential Development. You will report to George Smith and your start date will be June 13th, 1959. Yeah, you kind of hit the nail on the head there. We will provide you with your delivery truck, your uniform, and other important information on June 12th at the St. Marion Postal Office. We are pleased to include you in our family and are eager to see you at work. If you have any concerns, do not hesitate to contact us as possible. Sincerely, a president. All right, so I'm going to be a postman. That's great. Time to sleep. <laughs> kind of scared to sleep now. The new job. Holy shit, that's evil as fuck. That's some goddamn Bible Black logos there. Gonna gonna fucking inhale a lethal dose of marijuana tomorrow morning to get me prepped for my new job. Ah, uh, that's a cool camera angle. What a nightmare I had last night. Didn't know I was such an imaginative guy. I better get going and meet my new boss. Like, even this guy is overly cheery. So yeah, there's this kind of subtle filter on things. Can't really... Can I just leave? Is this like RE4? No. Not that way, Capron. Can I kill myself? I cannot. That's always my first go-to or I have a run. What... Okay, what is that white light at the top? It hap... Is it my stamina, maybe? Yeah, I think it's my stamina. As soon as I start running... Yes, okay, and it, and, it, and it goes back. That's neat. That's a little different. Yeah, definitely. All right. Uh, so let's get into town. It looks like it's over there. That's just a particle. I was going to say I hear wildlife, but I don't see it. Some voxel squirrels would be cool. All right, some power lines and these... Yeah, check. Little Vale, a lovely name for a lovely town. Everything is perfect. A weird green face won't jump out at me. 
Yeah, see, this is what I'm talking about. Why are you so fucking cheery? What's your, your big paws? Rachel, you're the new postman, aren't you? How do you do? You're the new postman, aren't you? How do you do? Now, there's a creepiness in the fact that if she did say that twice, like on her own accord, can't barge in someone else's house and rife through their shit. All right, can I guess that's just a no-go? No, I guess not. Uh, yeah, because if you do that, like people would freak out and they just shoot you instantly. Oh, look at this drama! I heard that Neil still holds on to his petty delusions. <laughs> look at that fucking hand. You never liked the man anyway, Laura. <laughs> man guy! Give the guy a chance, he'll turn around eventually. That's Bill. That's good old Bill. She doesn't like it. God, they look like squashed, like... Like uncooked pizzas. So many things happen over there in that cabin. It's overwhelming. That cabin? That... That, that, oh, let's go! Yeah, this does kind of stick out like a sore thumb in this idyllic little burg. Maybe it's just an illusion, but I feel like somebody's watching me in there. Okay, I guess that's it for that. Oh, uh, okay. Well, that'll become a thing later on in the thing. Uh, probably not yet, though. Let's see, everyone else. So I have to report to po Postman Postman Headquarters. All right, she is not important. I can't even talk to her. Good, because her outfit's ugly. Oh, you're loving it. Ah, Tim, what a stud. Where's Tim at? I want to see this stud. Okay, there's a man. Is he a stud? We'll see. Yo, look at this motherfucker. Holy shit, she wasn't kidding. Uh, once we're finished with this town, it'll be a nice place to stay. So this is the construction crew, huh? Let's check Tim out. Oh, yeah. Okay, there's this guy in this tight purple shirt. You're not as hot as Tim. Get my face. We have here. Grace, it's been so nice moving in this place all together. We built it from the ground up. What does Will have to say? Eddie, damn it. Thankfully, we have our kind pastor. He has been a leader to us, truly. That's not good. If there is a priest at the head of all this, like, not to, not to throw shade on an entire religion, but that probably means it's evil. It, it, like, it, since this is a horror game, you have to assume that, or, or maybe he, like, doesn't know, but, you know, I'm going to say it does. So here's the general store. There's this older man, Monsieur... Patrice, we haven't been here long, but as you can see, we built ourselves a nice little town. It's true, you guys have. That's the drugstore. It's open 24-7. This evil bitch. Violet, <laughs> I heard there was a very devious vagabond housing himself in our town. He's very devious. Isabella, I think he's spreading vicious lies about our community. The man's a loony. Mm, I'm sure he is. Or he's the only one that's sane. Is this another nice monsieur that's not even worth my time to talk to? Nope. Everyone that's old, I apparently can't talk. Oh, here's the post office. Eh, I saw that guy earlier, but whatever. George, hey there, lad. I'm in charge of the post office. Just check the deposit box for any packages and deliver them to the respective addressees. Okay, that's weird. Why don't they just come here and pick it up? It's pretty simple. I pick up the package here and deliver it to someone. It's light and smells like wild berries. It's addressed to Rachel. I hope it's not a weird fucking box of uh, ladybugs, live ladybugs. Rachel, though. Oh, I have a weird, like, uh, package icon in the bottom right. It's kind of strange, actually. Rachel, I believe, was like the first chick that we... Yeah, you're this one that creeped me out initially. Oh my, thank you. These herbs are perfect for the special tea I'm making. Okay. That's bad that she's making special tea. Like, tea is gross enough. But special tea? I don't know. Alright, let's... Do I have a jump? No, I don't. I just got my little run run. A little postman run. So, I guess keep picking things up. 
These letters seem to be packed with pin-shaped objects that are addressed to Patrice. Who is near the general store, if memory serves. Why do you have weird acupuncture pins, sir? Ah, they arrive right on time. Thanks, lad. Enjoy your auto blow, sir! Fresh in the box. Um, so why do I even have, a, like, a postman truck? Like a mail truck, if there's just literally one block and a few stores? It's a shit town. Hey there, lad. I'm sure. Okay, so he's not even gonna give me encouragement. Thanks, thanks, George. I could use the boost. This one is heavy and compact. Books, maybe? It's addressed to the pastor. Hmm. Oh, there's these people. Hey, look, soon. What a place to live. Yeah, that's still a really weirdly small town. Okay, there's there's Tim. I can, I can feel his glistening abs from here. Mountains. There's not really much else. I don't know what this is. Just a pillar that... For nothing? All right, can I talk to these these yahoos? Neil, I just can't shake off the feeling that's going to go horribly wrong. Oh, what's this? Chuck, buddy, if you don't do this, you'll regret it. I'm warning you. Cindy, listen up, Neil. You have to get a hold of yourself. It's going to go horribly wrong, though. Jeez. So, yeah, even even the conversations you listen to them, there's a certain air of deviousness of uh, something hiding below uh, the pastor, right? So that's cool. I like this sort of setup, even though it's kind of a cliche. It's, it's still effective. There's the pastor. He's just holding vigil outside the church. Why aren't you all coming in the church? He don't look evil at all. My thanks. These volumes contain invaluable satanic, uh, valuable knowledge. Ellipses. Please join my Bible Black Club, son. Alright, let's I guess we have one more package to deliver. Is this all the game is or we're gonna get to the meat of it eventually. Deposit. Looks like that was the last package for today. Once I'm done wandering around, I should go check in at that hotel. Wowzers! How long have you been in the business? You're a natural lad! I've never seen someone deliver so many auto blows. Anything else around? Like, I didn't really go in here. I kind of looked at that. That was weird. I thought I saw something. There's that shack, but wasn't really. Hey, those, those stone formations look devious. Oh, wow. These construction dudes should work harder on this. this the, the sod they laid in was not really flush with the ground. Yeah, that's fucking weird. This pile of rocks is pretty odd. It's their fertility goddess. That's pretty cool, actually. A pile of rocks is good. I like that. Okay, behind the church here, there is this. This looks a little scary. This place is locked up. Could there be wild beasts in the woods? Yeah, I'm sure that's what it is. Uh, maybe we'll get there eventually, but uh, let's head back to the motel. Uh, I assume that ends the day, that type of thing. Uh, it, it reminds me a little bit of Call of Cthulhu, actually, when we had to check into the hotel. And that was like the main goal <laughs> for a while. Light sleeper. That's weird. So every time do I, if I fall asleep, is it is it nightmare time? Is it, it Scaresville? Instead of uh, Night Vale or whatever this is? Okay, I, I guess I'm waking up from bed. This is the motel, I assume. I thought I'd get a lay in the land and talk to someone. Whoa. Yeah. yeah do I have a flashlight? No. Uh, flashlights didn't, didn't get invented until the 1980s, so... It, I don't know what I was thinking to think that there'd be a flashlight. No, can't check anything. Can't go into the bathroom. That's the first... Wait, why is my door open? Yeah, no, I noticed that, but thought I heard a weird noise there. Great, okay. Can I open up people's doors? It's pretty rude of me, but 
Man, I have like a giant motel just for this place. Is it really needed? Alright. I keep hearing things. Is it my own guy's own footsteps? Yeah, that's usually... That'll usually scare me. No, I, I don't think... Yeah, there's that, those fabulous skyboxes. What kind of animal makes that sound? What? I didn't hear anything. Hmm. Can't even tell what that is. Something trashed this place, that's for sure. And, okay, for a second I... Fuck. Um, check. What is this doing here? I guess it's weird for a lantern to be there. Can I pick that up, or...? Because E is, is everything, it seems. If... Ah! Fuck! Holy shit! Hello? Who am I talking to? God damn! Oh, whoa! Yeah, you keep doing you. Holy shit. Let's move on ahead. Uh, oh, man. Matt don't like. What is that sound? There's like little pitter-patters. I'm not a fan. What a mess! What could have happened in this room? It takes it to excess. Is that thing just going to appear, like, whenever? Because, no. This video might as well be over. Oh, fuck. That's so fucked up. Didn't even have to use a loud sound to get me, either. I mean, I guess visually it was kind of a loud... ho oh! Uh, <laughs> uh, okay, let's try the elevator. The elevator won't come up. Well, fuck me. Of course it won't. Oh, man. I don't like this. Do not like... Oh, Jesus. Okay. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, the spider and the fly. Okay, sure. Another nightmare. I've got to get a hold of myself and deliver these nice folks their packages. It's uh, not so perfect and idyllic outside today. Wow, that that was some effective stuff there, Helltown. Chuck, never heard of a guy named Neil. No, sir. Yeah. That's how you do these types of things. Anyone that has a dissenting, uh, you know, opinion, they're just gone. Neil? Neil who? Yeah. All right. Okay, why is that woman in the bushes? That's creepy. That's where I usually am. I hate that dog. I always hide in the bushes when he comes around. Fuck you, lady. A, I don't even see a dog. And B, fuck you. Yeah. Look at him. Hello. Yeah, look at this dog. I hate him. Look how awful he is. What a bitch. Well, it is kind of freaky that he does that, though. 
Hi, doggy. Okay. Let's talk to everyone. She seems to be stuck near the general store. It's hard to get out of there. Okay, he just follows me around now. That's cool. Maybe he'll protect me against all these fucking weirdos. No, you're nobody. Uh, Claire, can't wait to try Rachel's special tea. Yeah, I bet, asshole. Can I go and go in the drugstore? I could stop by sometime and get some vitamins. I feel drab. Not sure if this was here before. Maybe they're springing up. Maybe it's a pop-up. It's a pop-up store. Maybe they, they construct during the course of the game or something. Let me see the pastors out here. I don't believe this guy could ever talk to. Hey, let's bring Doggy. Where's Doggy? Fuck, there you are. Let's bring you over to the person that hates you. Let's see what they have to say. Do you like this? I hate that dog. Always out of the bushes. Yeah, well, he's here now performing for you. He's right there. You see him? You see him? Face your fears, Grace. Let's see if the pastor has any insight. Madman or otherwise. Have you ever heard about the tale of the spider and the fly? I have not. The spider was about to eat the fly, you see, and the fly begged very hard not to be eaten by the spider. But spiders, they don't have ears, so the fly got eaten anyway. Fascinating, don't you think? Alright, let's get on. I can do my postmans. Come on, lad. These packages don't deliver themselves. Yeah, I know. I know. Actually, they can. People just can clearly come to this fucking deposit box and just do it. Let's do this! It feels soggy. The smell is horrible. It's addressed to Laura. That's gross. Dog, you deserve better than this place. Nothing better happened to that fucking dog. I swear. So Laura, I kind of forget who she was, but there she is. There it is. It goes nicely above my fireplace. Okay. I think I'll go check out the shack, too. Just to see if anything's up with that. It's an unfolded piece of paper. It's addressed to Violet, uh, who was an old lady, I think. I wonder if Tim's around. I need some encouragement, Tim. Where are you at? Where are you, Splat Tim? Ooh. Oh, this isn't Tim. Greg, yeah, you're using the leftover materials from the houses. Yeah, we're using the leftover materials from the houses. Okay. Well, it was about time. Oh, there's Violet. Good. Okay. But I want to get her going. What are you still doing here? Fuck you. I have feelings. Yeah, we're using leftover materials from the houses. Okay, I still don't know what that means. Ooh, tunnel, tunnel. Oh, what's this? I didn't really see this. Oh, look, a playground. I can do my parkours all day here. What is this? I guess... I mean, is this how you construct shit, really? It looks real bad. It looks like fucking Montreal construction, which is slow, inefficient, and corrupt. Um, hmm. Uh, okay. I got that. Anyone staring at... Okay, there's this woman again. Let's see if she has anything else to say. Lila showed us. She has shown us so much. Oh, Maud. Maud, what has Lila showed you? Maud. Jesus. Huh. There's another one. And I can't interact with it. Check. There's something about that dingy old shack. It's abandoned, but it still feels like there's something inside waiting. Okay. Weird that... Okay, that wasn't there the first time, obviously, that I was here. The fact that I can't pick it up is really weird. Do I have a crouch? I do not. It's a circular stone with three symbols on it. What am I supposed to do with that? Well, since we just came from the shack, why don't we try that? Just because, like, that seems like where it would go. Huh. Yeah, there it is in the bottom there. Hmm. 
No. Damn. I thought for sure that would work. Oh, there, there's another one. Okay. Alright, here's another one. It's near the edge of the map. Okay, all three things are now glowing. Did, did I collect enough? I, I still don't really get how this thing works. Okay, there's a cave here. Jesus. I just found this. Whoa! Whoa! The ceremonial night. I guess I beat that. I'm not looking forward to this part now. Whatever I need to do. Oh shit. Am I on the other side? Yeah, I am. Flashlight! Okay, I was incorrect. First, I have to toggle flashlight. I'm locked out on the other side. What the? I'm locked in! Holy shit. Oh, fuck. Oh, I don't know which way to go. Let's just keep going this way. Oh my god, I am pretty freaked out. What the fuck? Like, I have no guns. All I have is run. So, if any... If anything does show up, I just run, I guess. Oh! Oh, shit! What the... Okay, something, some cr creepy crawly came out of the woods and just, just killed me really, really fast. Alrighty then. Let's, let's stick to these lighted paths. Here, there's a map here. I, d I, d I didn't, you are here, Main Street. You are here. So I'm kind of behind and to the, that's the gate. So I'm in front of a house? How am I in front of a house? Oh no, I'm not in front of a house. I'm in front of the fucking sign. So I guess I need to collect these keys. I'm assuming that's what I need to do. So there's three and and avoid the monster. Great, so. <sighs> Fuck, where's the key? Jesus. Okay, I have one. That's sick. I'm the best that's the ever was. Okay, I'm already fucking lost. Where's the sign again? Shit! <laughs> no. Dudes, I do not like this. How am I supposed to beat this? Oh, I don't. If I don't look behind me, it can't beat me. Yeah, there's three locks. Oh, fuck. I don't know if there's like ah, fuck. Ah, uh, you get hit once and you're fucking killed. You can't do much. Be what the? Okay. I feel so cold. Am I dead? I don't know. What the? Check. Chills are running down my spine. I better not disturb that thing. Let's not. And I... I don't have anything to do here. You again. 
can't even check you. What do I fucking do? Like, I can't interact with anything. Maybe this is like a game over state. Like, you know, some games will, like, put you in a death state and put you in, like, a little pocket dimension to try to escape. I was running down my spine and better not disturb that thing. I mean, I assume he means that, but I thought he also meant that, whatever that is, a little goblin guy. But, okay, I fell down a hole. Maybe before I died, I triggered something? Holy shit. Talk. This human comes to us from beyond the shroud. Has he met the giant, I wonder? I, I, I wouldn't have assumed I could talk to this thing. What's this? Anything? That's just, I look at just a pixeled cobweb. <laughs> oh, great, Matt. There was nothing there, you idiot. Okay. I don't know about you guys, but that seemed really hard to get all those keys and everything. If you get hit once by that monster, which is incredibly hard not to, you just seem to always get hit a second time, and two hits you were dead. So maybe you were not supposed to win that? I could be wrong. I don't, I don't know what it looked like to all of you. At least all these guys seem to get the point of this area, you know? Hello? Hi? Your upside down cross. Do you like that? It's, it's stylish. It's very edgy. It's very 2002. Ah! <gasps> Holy shit! And now I'm back here. Great. Alright, I feel so cold. Let's... Let's just do this. Uh... Let's just get farther in this. Cause I don't know, man. That, that, that thing seems really tough. These humans praise the Dark Shroud. This switch serves the Dark Shroud. Okay. Sure. So you're saying different shit. Is this a different layout? It looks slightly like a different layout. Okay. 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 That was Helltown. Uh, it gets brutally hard after a little while. I, I'm, I'm sorry, I can only play this so long, but uh, it, it's got an old school roughness of it at, at, the, at the, this part, obviously. I'm a little frazzled. But uh, yeah, no, this is this is a good game. It's 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 on Steam. Uh, try to beat it if you can. Uh, maybe I'll watch like an LP or something on YouTube. Uh, but uh, uh, points for creepiness, definitely, and taking a different type of aesthetic than most uh, first-person uh, Steam horror games. Good stuff.